but I want to go home I got to go home Let me go home I'm Danny Gardner and uh, we've been coming here now since the committee or well, since about 1973 and Tommy just remind me the first time that uh, the first memorial was in place was uh, about 20 people turned up now this time around it's great to see so many younger people who are coming because one of the things that we want to keep going is that if you're not vigilant with safety, these things will happen again. And uh, make certain that when you are on your job, you work safe and make certain of that. So you go home in one piece. This bridge actually cost 36 lives. Um, 35 on that day and one after. It actually collapsed on a Thursday. And today's 45th anniversary is a Thursday. I picked up the Australian aeroplane today and I normally read the Australian, the front, front page, guess what was on the front page? I'll tell you one thing, it wasn't about the 36 people that died building this bridge. It was about a thousand crimes committed by the CFB of the Union for going onto sites to make the work, workplace safer. And we've been prosecuted for that. And you know what? Sometimes you sort of think to yourself, geez, maybe we're dinosaurs, maybe we're, are we really, you know? And you know what? This sort of brings it home. Things like this bring it home. And we should never ever let people forget. We should honour the memory of people that have died at work. I mean, you know, if you're a construction worker, we're in a, we're in a deadly industry, high risk industry. I mean, you're four times more likely to die working on a building site than in any other workplace. If our union and other unions keep getting fined millions of dollars because we're saving one, if we save one life and it's cost our unions 20, 30 million dollars, we've done our job. That's one family that don't have to grow up without a dad or without a brother or without a son. One building worker is seriously injured or killed every seven minutes just in Australia, not the world, in Australia. And they're pretty sort of damning statistics. And we've got to try and make, make sure that everyone that goes to work goes home safe. I've got to go home.